Welcome back to the Homeowner's Cookbook. I wanted to do a quick follow-up video. In the video I made of putting the sliding barn door on, the tips video, I talked about not being sure what the noise level was gonna be. So we had just put the door on and it's on our bathroom. So show you the bathroom here. And there was a crack between the door trim and the sliding barn door. It was around three quarters of an inch, uh, maybe a little bit less. And so I wasn't sure if the noise of the bathroom would come through that crack, if we'd be able to hear it very well in our living space. Well, it turns out that it is kind of noisy. So is it noisy putting a barn door on the bathroom? It's, it's noisier than having a door that shuts closed and sealed. So if you had a regular door, uh, just like this door here, where it's got the door frame, and when you close the door, it creates a seal, right? On this, because it's sliding, you need to have that gap so it doesn't actually close tight. So what I did, I wanted to show this to you, and I don't know if this is gonna work or not, I think it'll help, um, is I cut these little strips of hardwood. I think this is poplar. We stained it, same stain as the door, and they're a little less than three quarters because you've gotta compensate for the swing in and out of the door between the door and the wall. And so I made them just a little bit narrow. So there still will be a hairline crack, um, but much less, uh, it's over half an inch less on both sides. So my hope is that the sound kind of catches that and bounces back rather than bouncing out um, because sound waves bounce. So if you're in the bathroom doing whatever you're doing and the sound is hitting the door and coming out the crack, hopefully it'll hit this and this will stop. We'll see. So I'm gonna put the door back on. Hopefully, if you guys are looking for a solution, this is one solution. Just uh, cut a strip of hardwood, uh, stain it the same as the door, and tack it on there. I uh, countersunk the screws, and make sure you drill first. You don't wanna crack that hardwood. All right, guys, real quick, it's been a couple of weeks, but I wanted to pop in at the very end of this video to let you guys know um, that after I put this strip of wood right here, um, on the door so when I close the bathroom door it closes up that gap right there much smaller than it used to be um, I can report that it is a lot quieter um, it does provide much more of a sound barrier um, and obviously there's still some noise because it's just right through this wall right through this wall um, so you're gonna get a little noise did put some insulation some of the interior sound um, canceling insulation in but you still hear a little bit uh, but it's way better than it was before I put this strip of wood in so if you guys end up putting a barn door on your bathroom um, give some some consideration to closing that gap however you end up doing it if you did it like I did or a different way close that gap between the door trim and the door itself you'll reduce noise a lot um, and we're very happy with this so if you've got questions Throw them in the comments below. I'll do my best to answer them. And I'll talk to you guys later.